<laughs> the first real act of the show. Check it out. The hook all the way through my skull. Oh. Bit of lubrication. <laughs> Relax, I've done this before. <laughs> Here we go. This is what I like to call the do it yourself or bother me. <laughs> Did you like that? Well, I'll tell you what, that was just my entree. And now, it is time for my main course, sword swallowing. And check it out. This is a 65 centimeter samurai uh, double-edged sword. It's not made of rubber, it does not retract, it is, in fact, the genuine article. Now, folks, before I slide the blade down my throat, I know there's skeptics out there. There's a lot of people who still think that sword swallowing is a trick. So before I swallow it, I'm going to prove beyond a doubt what you're seeing is literally 100% real. Check this out. One quick demonstration. <laughs> It's not that sort of show, ladies. <laughs> Sorry, folks. I was young. I needed the money. I don't do that anymore, okay? <laughs> now, check it out. Before I swallow the blade, I'm going to show you how real this is. It's a double-edged blade. Both sides are sharp. It's real. It's live. <laughs> and it's bloody dangerous. Here we go. Now, folks, uh, as you heard, I do actually hold 11 Guinness World Records. Right, that's actually true. Two years ago in Sydney, live on the Today Show, I managed to swallow 27 sword blades at one time. And 27 swords simultaneously pushed down my throat. Now folks, it's a little bit harder than it looks. <laughs> in order to do this, I have to stretch my throat with hoses for three days prior to the demonstration. I used meditation and internal isolation to control the muscles of my internal organs. But I've also changed my body to enable me to do what I can do. I had these magnets inserted into my chest. They hold the swords together, pull them away from my heart, and now I can fit more blades down my throat than any other sword swallower has attempted before. Now, folks. You can see photos in the Guinness Book of Records, you can see videos of that stunt on the internet and x-rays as well, it's pretty cool. <laughs> so right now, I'm going to show you guys something even more amazing. You are about to see an act that has literally baffled doctors and scientists around the globe. An act of internal isolation. I'll show you what I mean. I'm going to hold the sword in my throat at the height of my Adam's apple. And at this point, I'm going to let go. With my arms outstretched, I'm going to get all of you beautiful people to help me with the countdown. Everybody count from 10 down to 1. And on the word 1, using only the muscles of my insides, the sword will drop. And look how deep it's going to go. Giving a whole new meaning to the term deep throat. It's alright, the kids don't get it, it's fine. <laughs> if they do, it's your fault, not mine. So, <laughs> what the hell? Here we go. Sword swallowing like you've never seen it before. Check it out. I'm going to really quickly sterilise the blade with an alcohol wipe. I'll make it nice and clean, 
nice and slippery and I'll slide it all the way down my throat. I should say at this point, kids, kids, always sterilize. Ah <laughs> oh, no, that was a joke by the way. <laughs> but seriously kids, please do not try this at home. No, don't do this. If you put knives in your throat, you probably will die. Don't try this, okay? I'm like a cartoon. I always bounce back. It's fine. Here we go. Here we go. Check it out. Sword swallowing. Wait, wait, wait. I know there's more people here than that. Everybody count. Everyone. From ten down to one. Join in if you know the words. Are you with me? Yeah! If that's all you've got, I'm not going to do it. Are you with me? Yeah! That's more like it. Don't let me down. I'm going to risk my life for you people. After this, after this, I'm going to show you something that's really going to freak you out. Don't let me down. Here we go.